Uh, hello everyone, Jonathan from LandsandLots.com here, I'm bringing you another property uh, for sale. And uh, as it pops up on your screen here, you'll be able to see that it is located at 108 Heel Avenue, Northwest in Lake Placid, Florida. Uh, this property is 80 feet wide on the street by 125 feet deep. That is uh, 10,000 square feet or just under uh, a quarter of an acre. <clears throat> what we're going to do here in Google Earth is we're going to actually bring you uh, right down onto the street. As you can see, it is a paved road. Uh, there is some brush on the property, but would be very easy to clear. And uh, here is the house uh, next door, directly to the south, just to give you an idea of uh, some of the properties that are in the area. And again, as you can see, a uh, nice paved road. Um, <clears throat> electric and water are on the street, but a uh, septic tank would be needed for this property. So what we're going to do is we're going to uh, bring this back around here. And we're going to leave Street View. We're going to go back to the aerial. And uh, as we come south a little bit from the property here and straightening this out, uh, we're going to zoom out. As you can see, some other properties here in the area. But this is in the Placid Lake subdivision. And that is actually on a golf course. Uh, right here uh, is a pond that's in the area. And as we zoom out a little bit here in the subdivision, uh, you can see the property up here to the north, and the golf course comes into play uh, down here below. Uh, this is the Placid Lakes Country Club. Uh, it's actually an award-winning golf course, uh, 18 holes, and um, the link uh, for that will be uh, below for you to take a look at. Uh, but it is uh, right here, right around the corner uh, from the property. <clears throat> so as we uh, zoom out a little bit more here, I'll straighten this out, I'll let you take a look here. Uh, again, uh, just north of the property here, you can see a very large lake, Lake June in winter. Uh, and uh, you can see the size of this uh, in comparison to what's around. And as you can see, just north of the property, uh, there isn't uh, a whole lot being done. Uh, so basically, you don't have to worry about uh, a lot of traffic and, and things like that in this area uh, as uh, nothing is being developed. And then, of course, with the water uh, up here, it, it helps you to see uh, that nothing further can go in. And if we zoom in here, you can see some boats and stuff on the water just to help you appreciate uh, just how large uh, this body of water is. There's a boat here in the screen, and then there was one down below. So it just helps to put in perspective how large it is. Uh, as we zoom out uh, a little bit more, uh, Route 27 uh, comes into the picture here, uh, now in about the center of your screen. And that basically is a north-south route through Florida. As we zoom out a little bit more here, uh, Sebring comes into the picture to the north, and basically what you're looking at right here is about uh, 100,000 in population. So uh, a decent area uh, in size and um, definitely everything you need, but yet still in a rural part of the state. So that is nice. And uh, we were speaking earlier about this lake right here and the size of it and uh, showing you the boats and things. And uh, if you come over here, you see one that makes that look rather small. Uh, so it's a nice recreational area between the golf uh, course that's right there, other golf courses in the area, and then, of course, these lakes all around that you can go uh, fishing in, you can go boating in, and things like that. <clears throat> As we uh, zoom out uh, a little bit more, uh, you start to see Lake Okeechobee down here, uh, one of the largest uh, freshwater lakes uh, in, the, uh, in the country. And then uh, you see the Atlantic Ocean. Uh, that's over to uh, the east. And then as we zoom out a little bit more, you start to see some of the major cities and things in the state. There's Orlando uh, just to the north, Sarasota and Tampa are to the west, um, uh, where it says Cape Coral. That is the Fort Myers area down to the southwest. And then, of course, you go West Palm Beach and uh, coming down here into Fort Lauderdale and the Miami area. So, again, uh, a nice property uh, located around uh, uh, many lakes, uh, a lot of different activities. And, uh, again, a nice golf course community. So details about that and uh, owner financing are below. And of course, uh, if you're interested in other properties, uh, please make sure to check out our website and sign up for our free VIP newsletter. Uh, you'll be informed of any new properties uh, that we get and uh, any special promotions or anything like that uh, that we do as well. So have a great one and hope to talk to you soon.